What up team, so today I'm going to be comparing three apps to see which one is the best other than Minecraft. You see, no matter what reason you want to get these, just because you want something different than Minecraft, or because you can't, I like, you know, you got like two bucks or something, and you don't have quite enough to pay for that six ninety nine. you know, the seven bucks for Minecraft Pocket Edition. So the first one I'm going to be talking about is Mine Builder. This is two dollars in the app store. 199 and it has a couple features I'm not really going to gonna go into um full review of this but this is a world I already did and it does have skyblock and there was stuff in the chest I just took it out so I'll go back to the menu and start a new world <laughs> Oop, wrong button sorry all right okay so you can do survival hardcore or creative then hills, flat, skyblock, or yeah. So that's pretty much it for, um, actually I'll show you, like, the gameplay real quick. So, just, just to give you a general idea, you know, I keep pressing that button, okay. Okay, create it. Okay, I guess this is it, whatever, I'm gonna have to play this. But just to give you like a general idea, it looks pretty good. I like the detail, and it is, it does fit iPhone 5 screens, just in case you didn't, you know, just in case it's not updating, you know. So it, it does get updated. Um, yeah, the, it feels good in your hand. You know, that's a good thing about this. It kind of feels better than um, Survival Craft or the other one. But yeah, that's pretty much all I'm going to show for now. Now let's get to the other game right here, Survival Craft. This is $3.99 in the App Store, so it's 2 bucks more than Mind Builder. So, we'll see if it's worth it. I mean, I'm not... First off, I'm going to say I'm not sure it is. I mean, this is more popular than Mind Builder, but... I don't know, I'm not sure. So... Actually, I think I think there's multiplayer in this. Nope, I guess not. Okay, so new world. You can do the name, and there are seeds. Challenging, cruel, creative, harmless. Cool. And but it does have world options when you're in creative. And then I guess that's it. I thought. Um. Okay. Okay, I actually thought that you could do, like, super flat and stuff, but I guess you can't in this game. But either way, here's how the start looks. You just get stranded on an island, apparently. There are a bunch of chickens in front of that ship. Yeah. There's me. Alright, so I'm gonna say the, the controls don't feel as good in this game as in Survival Craft. It feels a little bit chunky, like, I don't know. It, it just feels kind of weird to me, because, like, to cr you can crouch and stuff, and... I don't know, it's definitely different. Um, I still think it's good. I haven't really played either of these in depth. I'm probably going to be deleting them after this. But this is for those people who want to go further than Minecraft, I guess. Or just can't afford Minecraft, you got, like, two bucks or something. So, I guess that's it for this game. If you tag the bulls... Or actually, I think if you attack the cows, the bull attacks you. Yeah, so the bull, the bull attacks you. Then you're screwed. And this doesn't have a food bar. You just eat, and then it re re heals you, just like in the old Minecraft stuff. Yeah, I'm gonna try if they, if that's the way it is in Mind Builder too. Yeah. Okay, okay, yeah. It looks like it's the same thing in Mind Builder here, for your health. Lunacraft. Okay, so this is a free game. Don't expect too much of it. Um, so the reason why I'm putting this in here is just because it's free. I know it's it's not really like Minecraft. I mean, it's the same idea, but you're on a moon, I guess. So, you know, it's the same premise, though, in case... And lag, lag, lag. It's the same premise. I mean, it's not my favorite. I don't like it very much. But still, it's free. It does have ads in the top corner unless you guys want to get rid of them. I think it, you have to pay. 
But you get a gun to kill things. And you get a drill to mine stuff. Then you can build with it. I it's it's actually pretty fun. It's kind of like old arcade-ish, like the sound effects. But yeah, so I mean it's it's free. So you know, what are you going to do? It's free. So that's pretty much it guys. That's the three games I have for Minecraft alternatives. Hope you guys enjoyed. I'll leave the names again in the description and the prices. Um, I'm going to have to say the one that you should most likely get would probably be Mind Builder. Don't judge me for any of that. Because I'm not a big fan of Survival Craft, actually. I mean, it's kind of hard to control. And, I don't know. And you can do Skylock and stuff in um, Mind Builder. And I've known about Mind Builder for a long time. I had that game before I even had Minecraft Pocket Edition, I think. So, either way, I'm no pro. Let me know what you think down in the description. Thanks for watching, guys. Peace out. Hope you enjoy the video. Happy, happy crafting.